What's up, everybody? It's Red Bull with TV. Bring you another video. And today, we have another rambling video. And you know why I'm really excited? We're going to get into that later. But for now, for now, we're going to talk about Drake. <laughs> I mean, I swear to God, I'm not going to make another rambling video for a while. Like, this is the last one for a period of time. So, I'm, I'm happy that's happening. Uh, but... For now, we're going to talk about Drake. Because Drake, you know, I don't want to call Drake my guy. Because he's about, uh, like, 100 million other people's guys. Uh, but I listen to him a lot. He, if I had to pick a favorite rapper, it would be him. Maybe not. Maybe he doesn't write his own rhymes or anything like that. But, like, with that even, uh, I don't think if you don't write your own shit, I don't take anything away. It's just if you do write it, I plus. So, like, there's no negative to it. It's just, if you do it, okay, I think highly of you. If you don't, I, I don't really give a shit uh, uh, that you don't. It, it doesn't affect what I think of you at all. So Drake's already number one. Everybody knows Drake is number one. So he released an album, uh, clearly playing into the streaming category because he's trying to rack up as many streams as he can. He released 25, I believe it's 25 or 24 songs. Uh, two different sides. Now, that he released that much. And didn't make it two different albums so that he can uh, rack up as many streams as he can, make as much money. I don't hate him for that. People are hating on him for that. I don't hate it. That's why he did more life like that. I don't give a shit. Make your money. Even if even if you've got multi-millions, uh, keep making your money. I don't care. So I got a couple highlights for you. So there's the two sides. Uh, and uh, one of them's uh, rap and one of them's R&B with uh, some, uh, more, some songs more rappy in the R&B side than others. Uh... And these are my favorite moments on the album. Some of them are just full songs. Some of them are just verses uh, in particular. So the first one that I have, uh, I made this last night. Uh, the first one that I have is uh, Drake's second verse on uh, uh, Emotionless. That, that was, that, that's probably one of my favorite verses out of the whole thing. Because uh, that one is specifically, I believe that's when he's calling out all the girls on Instagram, all that shit. Which like fucking pisses me off myself. Um, but then also he, he, it's the first time I believe that he, uh, he, he references his kid in the album and, uh, he does it in a pretty dope way. He says, uh, I wasn't hiding, uh, uh, my kid from the world. I was hiding the world from my kid. So, I mean, fuck yeah. Uh, eight out of 10. Um, that is the most, that's the biggest banger on the, the album. If you ask me that one, uh, that one bumps, but what I want to talk about specifically with this is, uh, the the first lines in the song he says too rich for who uh and then i forget what he says after that specifically but he says like too rich for who uh and then like uh other shit but like the too rich for who and specifically i think he's talking about kanye there and then the other shit he starts talking about like push t a little bit like very uh very um you know kind of uh kind of vague like not specifically talking about pusha or like maybe talking about p diddy people like that uh, but yeah, so I think that one was specifically Kanye. Next one uh, is Jay Z mentioning X and Zimmerman in um, "Take It, Take It, Take It, Take It, Take It Back." I don't know, dude. Uh, uh, I don't. I forget what the song's called. Um, but you know which one I'm talking about. It's the only one. With, it's a one. Uh, no, this is more than one feature. But I don't really listen to the other features uh, because. Uh, they're the they're the more fucking R and B like slow and I don't like that Drake. I do not like that Drake. I don't like uh, when Drake goes outside rapping or at least uh, if you're gonna infuse singing, infuse it into a rap song. I'm fine with that. Yeah, I'm fine with that. Okay. All right. Next one. First half of March 14th. That. Ah, oh, dude, dude. So Drake. Th this also goes into another one. It's the first half fa first half of March 14th, and is there more? So this is these two, uh, not the second half of March 14th, these two are my favorite fucking versions of Drake. It's when Drake gets a beat, and the main part of the beat is just a remix, like the whole thing is just like a remix of um, a sampled voice, and that's when he goes off on his best. It's when he just gets mad personal, he gets all that shit, and he just starts going off. You, you see it on uh, Do Not Disturb, Pound Cake, uh, 30 for 30 Freestyle, all that shit. That's that's when Drake is at his best and he does that stuff. Cause the only song I play off "What a Time to Be Alive" is, or I still play off of it, is uh, "30 for 30 Freestyle." The only one I play off "More Life" anymore is "Do Not Disturb," and the uh, the one that I play the most 
off of um well the one that i play the most off of uh uh it, it, it nothing will be the same uh is a uh, is a uh, uh, too much but that's because that, that that's my writing playlist but like if it wasn't uh then it would be pound cake but like because those are my favorite versions of drake and i thought that was dope um now march 14th i fucking pray i i i, I don't pray because that that doesn't make sense because it's already out i i wish i wish that this song did not include the second half of it all right all right uh, and then the next one is the Michael Jackson feature. I don't fuck with the song that much. I'm gonna have to go listen, give it another listen. I've listened to the whole album probably like three times. Uh, I'm gonna have to give it a listen again. Um, that song specifically. But, uh, as of right, as of right now, I don't like it. Uh, the Michael Jackson feature, I specifically pointed that out though, because it's fire. I mean, I, that's just what I mean. I, I mean, I wish this, uh, this feature was in a, a rap song. I wish that was like the chorus to it. Blue Tint. Blue Tint is on a uh, side B. It's very good. Very fucking good. Um, the first half of Final Fantasy. This is another one that I wish the first half was like the second half. Or the first half just uh, just uh, was the only song. I don't care how short it is. Just make that the only song. And the last song that I want to talk about. It's a full song. Sandra's Rose. Um, uh, another one that I want to mention is uh, Can't Take a Joke. But, um, Sandra's Rose, uh, that one, that one, as of right now, is tied with probably 8 out of 10. Yeah, Emotionless is up there, but that one's probably tied with 8 out of 10 for my favorite songs in the album, uh, so far. Which, obviously, my opinion chains, changes, uh, but as of right now, uh, those are my, uh, those are my top two. Alright, so that, I had to talk about Drake. I had to talk about him. But uh, now we are going to talk about uh, it's hot in here. Um, <laughs> right now we are going to talk about uh, fucking uh, my book. Um, yeah, we're gonna. I finished it. <laughs> I forgot. I was like, what? what where? What part am I at? <laughs> oh, I fucking finished that shit. Let's go. Uh, yeah, I, I did actually just forget that I finished it. Um, now, originally this video was gonna, gonna be Drake. But I did just finish the book. I fed through the whole thing. Uh, um, maybe uh, when I make a feature video on it, because I do plan on making strings of videos. I've already said that before. But uh, if I do, uh, that that will be um, uh, something. I, I, I in my mind just fucking bounces around. I thought I had already explained it. Um, no. So so the screen that I was uh, I was I was editing the final the final time that I was editing that the screen was all fucked up. Uh, uh, I think it was one of my brother's friends. They stepped on it and they just fucked it up. And then I didn't find out till like a day later because I just didn't. I didn't. I didn't edit or anything. I took like a day off. Um, but the show was all fucked up and like it sucked because like I I have to like read around the shit and like I think it's good. I'm very nervous for people to read it. I'm very nervous. Um, I'm gonna try and uh, get it into the Amazon thing tonight so that it will be published uh, either tomorrow very late or uh, sometime. Uh, either late the day after or midday the day after. If not, I publish it sometime around tomorrow and th and then just add on what I just said. Uh, that time frame. I'm excited. I'm excited and nervous. Uh, uh, I have one friend who is currently reading it. And I actually just told her, I said, because uh, uh, I've sent the link to probably about like three different people. But no one's read it fully through, and she's the only one reading it fully through. She's the only one getting a free copy. And then once, um, which is, it's just because I know my guy friends will not want to fucking uh, read read through a book in, like, a couple days. Like, I, I just know if you're watching this, I just know you won't. Like, and, and, and if, if I do, if I do make you do that, or just ask you to do it and you do do it, I know it's going to be torture. You're not going to want to do it. So... This way she does it, she offered to do it, and, uh, and, and so it works out for everybody. And, uh, she's, she's, uh, giving me an honest opinion about it. But I still am very nervous. Uh, uh, I haven't, I don't think I've said the title on here, but when you see the title, you'll probably, like, you know, I already, I said it in my Dragon Ball video. Um, you, you'll probably think, like, a type of way about it. But, let me explain it first. Just let me explain it first before you, uh, start judging it. Um... Because I think it's a little bit aggressive. 
Uh, let me think. Let me think. What the fuck else is there? Nothing. I finished the book. I finished the book, man. It feels good. It feels fucking awesome. And I know. I know this is my third rambling video in a row. Uh, but give me a second. Give me a second. Let me explain to you why. Because I finished the fucking book. <laughs> that is why. That's why. All right? So don't, 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 don't. Don't be like, this channel's getting boring, or anything like that. Nah, fuck you. It's not. It will, it, it, maybe it is, but go watch some daily Reddit reviews, dude. Go, go watch some fucking daily Reddit reviews. Um, let me think. What else is there? Nothing else. There's nothing else. It's strictly the fact that I finished the book, and I feel good. Um, the cover is very, very, uh, uh I, ha I have a cover picked. Very bland, uh, you know. Um, but if I am going to choose another cover, it would be, uh, a little bit more complex, but probably not. Probably just a basic one. So thanks for watching. Everybody's been Red Bull with TV. <sighs> oh, the final page numbers is, uh, 206. So there it is. Thanks for watching, everybody. This has been Red Bull with TV. I'll see you in the next video. Make sure to subscribe, like, comment. If you're not going to do the last two, at least the first one. Bye.